Blizzard Entertainment presents. Here we go. It's a pinball machine. So they already have you put money into the game. That's cool. This is cool. It's already paid away. Okay. It's Hogger! I pulled his arm off? Oh, that's cute. I like that. That's cool. Oh, that's great. I got representation. I never get that. funny. I like that. Was that a JoJo reference? <laughs> wow. Yay. Arc light rumble? Okay. And I'm Adam, and today we have the honor of introducing you to Warcraft, Warcraft Arclight Rumble. Rumble! So what is this game? What is COVID game? really did something special to people. <laughs> COVID, it, uh... Strategy, fast-paced, hero collector... And villain this, collector. Look, and villain collector people spend all day in their house. ...vast PvE campaign. It also has dungeons and raids okay. and PvP and co-op and everything you'd expect of a Warcraft game from Blizzard. We love games. We were super inspired by tower defense games. Our game isn't really tower defense. It's more our style to do a tower offense game. <laughs> oh, that's good. Chaos. That's smart. And we're aiming to bring our Blizzard best to mobile games. It's an offense fire. game. Chaos reigns. All the chaos. Can't use chaos twice. Oh my god. I love how the beginning of the game is pay to win. But the beginning of the trailer, it's like, yes, it's pay to win. A mysterious machine has been found. Is it new? Has it always been there? Powered by gnomish engineering and arc light. This machine has been generating famous and infamous battlegrounds for your entertainment. Yeah. So when the battle begins, you'll come to the battlefield with your army, ready to go assault the boss. Wow. So there's a base for you to defend. If the base dies, your run is over. Also, okay. there's meeting stones on the map. If we control the meeting stone, we can play things closer to the boss. If the enemy controls the meeting stone, they're going to come at us a little bit closer as well. All right. There's also towers on the map for you to go capture that lets you have a forward position so you can assault the boss directly. There's also That's shinies cool. that you can get. There's gold nodes and treasure How much do those cost? Under. You gotta get the shiny. Give me the shiny. Shiny. The more gold that you can get, the more chaos you can reign upon the field. <laughs> This is so good. I love this. Every mini has their own personality. <laughs> I love this. Really this cool. is amazing. And they're all wrong, except for Blackrock Pyromancer. Yes! This is it's In so Warcraft, it's Arclight, so cringe. I think families. it's so funny. Oh my the god. With a lot of defensive units they're just having fun. Yeah. Uh, it's like they don't the even horde. care. The proud horde that will overpower. Okay, here we go. Heed my call. But there's also Black Rock to sear a hole in your enemy's defenses. Let's throw down! There's of course the undead. Who can bring a skeleton of troops to the battlefield. Nice. And beasts. Uh, we also have a literal stamp. I love this, this is so battle. good. With all of the chaos going on with the troops, we need somebody to lead this rabble. Leaders are a way to cater your oh, strategy and build a specific play style that suits you. If you want to play siege units, go for Sneed. Wow. Sneed has a trait called Sneed's Greed that makes all of your siege units grab extra gold. They First called it that? Ren, with his ability Black in the Sky, it makes all of your flying units one gold cheaper so you can fill the air with chaos. <laughs> chaos. There are tons of strategies okay. that you can summon. There are over 60 minis for you to play with. But you don't need to have an understanding of Warcraft to be able to embrace No shot. A 
sense of exploration and wonder should come across regardless. Speaking of wonder, let's go play a game. We're gonna do it live. Okay, I mean, it'll be let's go, let's later, see but it. That's okay. Welcome to Jinrok's Swole Troll Isle. Okay. Of strength. This is a fun map because I did the design for it and Justine did the art. We'd have our animators and our this character artists to make all this happen. There's so many people that go cool. into making this a reality. The goal of the Swole Troll Patrol is to punch your base in the face. Smash that start button. Let's go. Okay. Bro, I can, they're going to take this and turn it into those five-second phone gonna ads. Is have some harpies go say hello. There's a kobold yep. that's already trying to steal gold over there. We're going to let him go for that, though. There's a bat rider coming, and we have a huntress. Let's play a huntress to help this out a little bit. And here comes another swole troll. Let's okay. send out some chickens to meet that swole troll. Are they going to lose, like, in all the commercials? Relentless. I'm actually going to lose. No! <laughs> <laughs> We don't make these maps to be easy. I thought you said you couldn't lose. You designed this map. Smash that start button. Let's go. All right, here comes the uh, swole troll, and we need some harpies to go take care of that swole troll. Man, how about that? There's some chickens coming. I don't care about those chickens. Pre-watch, that call kobold, it. Yeah. I do. That kobold. It's part of the psycho. It's here. part of the psychological marketing with phone games. I'll talk about it later. Need some more gold though. Let's go mine this area right here so that we can fuel our harpy addiction. All right, good. Have those chickens come in and peck that swole troll. So they're just, just like it's a snack. They're oh my just gosh, pecking look at in the all death. These units coming in here, but one chain lightning is all we need. All right, that was cool. That was cool. Hopefully I that like that. Sneaks by. Aww. There you go. Woo! Overtime. Oh, we're in overtime. overtime. All right. Down to the wire. Harpies, come on. Time's running, Time's running out. Too close. All right. So all he's right, gonna right. lose. Let's do a wombo combo. Brilliant. I stretched. A suicide bomber, of course. That's just one of the 70 plus maps that we Thank have. Thank God we, had, we won because of that. One of my favorite maps is going back to Stranglethorn, deep in the jungle, is Gurubashi Arena. Kamikaze, King yeah. Nukla is there with his banunchucks and Banandalia. There's a couple of apes in Ungro that have some banana armaments. We've got oh the banana gun God. by Ukluk. Ungro also has Devil Sword Queen, the tyrant of the area. What about she King Ma? Stomping down, and you just have to take her down before she bites your base. Tasty base. What about King Ma? What happened to, to King Ma? Challenges depending on each map. Now it's it Queen Ma. Require you to be able to. I hate this political correctness bullshit, man. This is ridiculous. From a ship. There's so many ways King to who? customize your minis using talents. Their abilities okay. can be augmented in all different sorts of directions. Maev has a really awesome talent called Cloak of Shadows. Wherever you play her on the map, she will cast Smoke Bomb and stealth everything around her so you can make a mobile assault squad anywhere on the map. Oh, okay. Warcraft. Warcraft. Arclight. Arclight. Rumble. Rumble. They literally don't care. This game has they so actually don't play, care how cringe it is. Every single day, every single week. I feel like we're, we're going to completely go week. full circle. We're going to talk about dungeons. Where it's so dungeons, cringe it becomes Giga Chat. Or if you want to play co-op, you can as well. Oh my we god. We didn't talk about co-op. We forgot to talk about co-op. Oh my co god. You can join a guild. You can play with your friends. You can join a guild and you can fight your friends. Fight, fight, fight. Wow. You can go play raids with them. There's so many things to do in this game. We didn't talk about raids. You're it's just going to have to stay tuned for more information, aren't you? Wait, yeah. Close bid is coming to limited regions soon, so keep an eye on social media for more information. On behalf of the team, we are so excited yeah. for you guys to get your hands well, Why aren't they wearing masks? We really, really look forward to your feedback and input. Thank you so much for hanging out with us. Enjoy the joy. Enjoy the chaos. The chaos, it never ends. Chaos. 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 It's not over. <laughs> You thought it was over, it wasn't. It just keeps coming. Oh. Bro. All new Warcraft experience. Yeah, it is Jane. Oh, it's Grom? That's cool. Trailer's okay. I like it. It's not that bad. I'm not. I'm probably not gonna play this if it's all the way on phone, though. Jesus. I, 
Imagine if they announced this and said no expansion. That would have been fucking funny. That would have been really fucking funny. I, I wish they did that. That would have been great. Sneed's greed. Alright! Ah, looks like pure garbage. What the fuck? Su edit. Super excited to see the monetization model. Google Store warns that it involves random loot boxes. And it's on the blacklist in some EU countries already? No way. Let me pull it up right now. Uh, is it on the Google Play Store? No shot. I, I, I don't believe that. Um, Warcraft. Oh, oh, there it is. Google Store. Okay. Let's see. Can I find this? Um, interactive elements. Purchases includes random items. There it is. I found it. There it is. Includes random items. Now, I could have never expected this. Who could have possibly expected this? Sneed's Creed. I, I... I can't believe they use that. I honestly cannot believe they fucking use that. Wow. Um, Sneed's Creed. Yep. There we go. I just... Wow. Uh, mom, you can't... Mom, I need... Mom, get the credit card. <laughs> I need to get... Can I borrow? Can I get my allowance for next week today? I need it now. I need it now. Oh my god. They should integrate bonuses if you're a WoW subscriber. You know what they should do? They should actually do what this guy said. That would be great if we could play this inside of World of Warcraft, different in, different map. If they did this, I would actually play the game on Ironically. I think this would be so fucking cool. And I would actually play it. Yeah, I would play it. Like, why would I not want to play it? Uh, yeah, it's just... It would be great, man. And uh, Nazbaz pay to enter, pre-register on the Play Store, and from uh, what's this here? I can't pre-register for it on the Play Store, and I'm from Belgium. Isn't that interesting? Wow. Um. Uh, Jesus, that is that is really something. Something to do while you wait in a PvP queue. Yeah, Belgium Holland bans anything with loot boxes and gambling. Yep, there you go. The chat. What are they saying? Looks good. It's kind of cool. Don't you guys have phone? Revenge for Hots. I'll try it. Only respect of the Warcraft name, but this is insulting. Bibbly Y. Cringe Royale. No actual WoW tie-in. So sad. Cringe Craft Reforge. Garbage childish game made for adults with childish minds. Heroes of the Storm is better than this. So bad. Vandis. What for God's sake is this? Nice game for six-year-old kids. Bye. That would be great if we could play this inside World of Warcraft. Different end, different map. Oh, that'd be that's such a good idea, Conrad. We should be yeah, that's that's a great idea. Yeah, we should be able to play this inside a WoW. Dude, that'd be and that'd actually be fucking that'd be an awesome fucking idea. Yeah, that's actually that's a crazy good fucking idea. Wow. Bro, Conrad, like Jesus. Like, that's a smart dude. I, like, I'm gonna I'm screenshot this, put this on the fucking, uh, uh, uh like, I put this on the Twitter. This is an actual good idea. Like, what the fuck? Like, oh, what's this shit, dude? Give me a sec. Let me, let me get rid of this shit real quick. All right, where, where it be at? I gotta tweet this out, uh, about the, about the thing. This is actual, like, this is some real shit. Conrad's coming in here with the information. Let's see if I pull this up right around there, crop that shit out. There it is. Like, that's a smart dude. Uh, yeah, like, I, I, like, that's such a good idea. Let me, let me look at the rest of these, okay? Don't you guys have phones? Going to pay to win with time gating and chess purchasable with real money. Warcraft from moms. Why are they using Riot's engine for this? Don't you guys have phones? Warcraft, cringe fest. Uh, late April Fool's joke. 
Wow, expected so much more. No, God, please, no, no. Remember, most people who started Warcraft Saga are no longer here. Blizz is not Blizz we knew before. Yeah, because Blizz we knew before is in jail now. Um, It actually looks fun. So cringe, please cancel it. Hot take, I'm kind of hyped. Imagine if we have to pay for this. What do you expect to happen? Money thrown down the sewer. Garage Hellscream. Clash Royale. CR copy paste. The art style is nice, but not impressed with this gam. All right, give me a second. Uh, I'll I'll refresh this in just a minute, and we'll uh, we'll see what people have to say. So um, uh, we'll give it a uh, we'll give it a like. And uh, I I'm not curious who has the add on. Uh, how many? What's the ratio here? Does anybody have the uh, the ratio? We've got to figure out what this ratio is. Yeah, where's L L plus ratio? Where is it? Return YouTube dislikes. 4.2k dislikes. <clears throat> Blizzard has the best art style in the industry. They went out of their way to copy Clash of Clans art style. Holy moly. Yeah, that's great. Good idea. Uh, honestly, so here for this. Heckin' love these... Heckin' love these quirky edits. Can't wait to post this to r slash gaming. So hyped. Oh. Oh. I might have to unban Bat Chest just for this day. Oh my god. What is this? So, look. Um, let me, let me look at the rest of it before I, I go any farther. This is the worst thing Blizzard has ever put their name on. Great job. Is that really true? This, that's the most positive Blizzard fan. Okay. Do you guys want my actual opinion about this? Like, no meme, no bullshit, no anything. Like, obviously it's funny to read the comments, and it's funny to see people, like, mauled out over the phone game. I think this is fine. I, I actually, I'm glad, I think that having 35 cringe moments in a video is better than having one cringe moment in a video. I unironically do. Because at that point, like, there's just no, like, you, you it's like they clearly don't care, right? I mean, these are like, uh, it's like a middle-aged man, middle-aged woman sitting there just, you know, goofing and clowning around. They probably, the, the truth is, they probably had fun making that video. And I think that has, that, that there's some, there's some value to that. That they probably had fun and enjoyed making the video. It was lighthearted. It was goofy. It was really goofy. I don't think it was a big deal. I really don't. I thought it was funny. It was. And the thing is, what you guys have to understand is that us here, we are not the target audience. All right? You want to know who the target audience really is? That's the target audience. That's it. Who else got chills? Who else got heckin' chills off of that one? That's what it really is, guys. Let's be honest. I'm scarred for life. That's Gandalf. Yes, Izzy, uh, Izzy got these for me. And, um, and Gandalf, yeah, yeah, exactly. And so, yeah, she got those for me. And, uh, anyway, so I, I hold on to them for obvious reasons. However, I mean, that, those are the people that the, uh, that the, the content is for. This is not for somebody who's, like, some really big, like, oh my god, like, I'm a super elite, uh, Omega gamer or something like that. That's not what's going on here. Uh, I think that this is something that's made for people that they goof around. They're they're just they're just they're not gamers. This isn't something gamers are not the audience here. Okay, gamers are dead. There's no more gaming nowadays. Gaming is fucking over. Gaming is for losers. That's what happens. Gamers are 35, and they have a kid and a wife. They play for three hours a week. They spend money on video games. And they, they, they soy face whenever a new video game comes out. Yes! They collect Star Wars collectibles. It's exciting. Yes. Listen, guys. My honest opinion is I think this is fine. I do. I think this is totally fucking fine. This is exactly what I would have expected. 
This is exactly- I- I feel like they should use another thumbnail. Like, trust me. Like, guys, as somebody who- who has thumbnails like this all the time, you probably use another thumbnail. Um, it's just really- I mean, that's it. And, and so, let's read a few more of these, and, uh, we're gonna go- The strong how-do-you-do fellow kids energy this reveal emanated. I, I, like, I don't think that- I think it's how-do-you-do fellow boomers. Like, this is like 30, these are like 30 year old people. Like, that's all it is, man. Uh, heckin' based, I know. Of all the games Blizzard made, this is certainly, <laughs> well, of all the games Blizzard has made, this is certainly one of them. That's about right. Um, it's the worst thing I've ever seen from Blizzard. Uh, thank God, WoW Classic is still here. And big surprise, this comment comes from a middle-aged man who's bald. And where's the rest of these? Behold, the last gasp of the Warcraft IP. This is one of the games Blizzard ever made. This looks so underwhelming. Blizzard should be thanking YouTube right now for removing the dislike counter. <laughs> uh, my disappointment is immeasurable and my day is ruined. This is the worst thing Blizzard has ever put their name on. Great job. Generic looking pay to win hero collector? No thank you. What do you mean? What about Sneed's Greed? Come on. Oh my god. Uh, holy cow. Uh, when you think the Warcraft universe can't fall deeper, they announce this. This just shows Blizzard has the most garbage marketing analysis team known to man. This may generate a profit, but it just shows they don't care about their diehard consumers. See, I actually disagree with this comment. Uh, I think Daniel's wrong. Uh, here's why I think... Uh, it, here's why I think he's wrong is because they're not trying to appeal to their audience They're trying to appeal to a new audience and diversify the game. That's what they're doing. They're trying to do something different They're trying to expand the appeal of the Warcraft universe and I'm here for it. I think it's a good idea uh, it, It's like do you always want to play it safe and die out slowly or do you want to take some risks and do something different and crazy and kooky and just heck and wacko, you know? Yeah, go for it Let's see what some of the comments on Reddit are about this. I'm sure this is going to be great. Let's see if I can find it. It's going to be probably on the, um... I, I would watch this leaked mobile game. Okay, here we go. Let's see if I can find it. Arc Life Mobile. All right, let's, let's read this one. This is the actual, uh... Raid Shadowlands? Okay. Uh, I, I didn't know that was actually a meme. All right, let's see here. Let's see what people have to say about this. It's pretty fucking funny. I uh, expected nothing, still disappointed. It looks terrible. I was hoping for something more Warcraft 3 looking. Yep, it's a mobile game. Sums it up pretty well. It doesn't even look bad for a mobile game. It's just so, so generic. I don't know. I mean, when do, does the, the game's not out yet, right? Is it? Can I play the game now or not? No? Oh, okay. Uh, let's see here. Very shocked it's going to be a beta first. Fully expected a release today. Yeah, it really kills a lot of the hype it may have. It looks fun and refreshing. They're not taking it too seriously. A beta is so unnecessary. Just release the damn game. Oh, well, Blizzard thinks it's unnecessary to hire QA. So that's why a beta is necessary. It's not Clash of Clans. It's more like Clash Royale with more features. Uh, Blizzard made the, the most generic mobile game and slapped the Warcraft name on it. Looks fun. Mobile pet battles died for this. Looks like Clash of Clans, but WoW themed. Okay, that's nice. Now let's see what the Warcraft Classic separated has to say about this. Um, yeah, yeah, let, let's let's see this. Oh, oh no, it's not there. Oh no. They're not even talking about it. <laughs> they didn't even know what happened. Oh my god, what a surprise. Yep, what a fucking surprise. They don't have phones, guys. What, what else can you say? Yeah, they don't have phones. Imagine having a special reveal for this. I love tug of war games, Starcraft Arcade, so I'm sure I'll love this. I'm not sure I'm the target audience for this one. Why did the presentation need to be so cringy? Holy hell, that was a hard watch. I wonder how popular this game is gonna be. I, I really do. Like, what do you guys think? Do you all think it's gonna be uh, it's gonna be popular? I think that it could be. Uh, I I do. I I think that it actually could be very popular, and this could be a big game. Uh, obviously, it's not going to. You know what the funny thing is? This game might make more money than War World of Warcraft. Like, I I'm pretty sure this game will make more money than Diablo 3. Because mobile games print money. Like, they do. Because for every one of you guys that's like, Oh, this is so dumb, I hate this. There's like a few other people out there who are going to spend $150 in the first week of the game. 
That's what's going to happen. Mobile games are pure cancer. Yeah, they, but they're pure cancer. But, I mean, like, it, it's effective. I mean, it's very fucking effective. Uh, that's what it is. Why, why, with the market being so overcrowded, I don't know. I mean, Blizzard is huge, right? Mobile games make billions. Clash Royale was really popular, so it's like this game, Clash Royale 2.0. Yeah, I don't play any mobile games. Like, straight up, I don't play any. The only mobile game I play is Twitter. That's it. So I can't really say. Imagine Genshin made $33 million last month alone. Genshin Impact made $33 million in one month. And they can't even afford to give me a $5 million sponsorship to play the game for an hour. Like, I, I, these, these cheap fucks. I can't believe this. These cheap fucks. You know what? It should be $10 million. I didn't know that. It should be 10. What do you guys think? The audacity. Yeah, I know. Exactly. This is so outrageous. Expecting nothing. It's a disappointment. So, are you guys going to play this game? Let me ask you this. Are you going to play the game? Actually, can we do a poll? Because I know there are going to be some people that are like, oh, I don't go play game. But I bet a lot of people will. I do. I think so. Uh, it's still not up yet. I'll, I'll wait for the trial to come back up. Nopers, I'll try it out. Yes. Hell no. Hell no. I'll try it. Why not? I think I might try it. If I can play this on my PC, I will try it. Because I downloaded Bloons and it was fun. Like, Bloons was great. So, like, I'd like to see more Bloons or something like that. It'd be amazing. Uh, I hope that we get more of that soon. That would be great, man. And uh, please don't make... Uh, uh, what's this? Please don't play more herd trial. Oh, yeah, right. Okay, so this is this the change the content just for me shut up Everybody likes watching it. We're gonna do it. Um, anyway, let's see here Android emulator on PC Yeah, but I don't want to play it on an emulator. You know what I mean? Yeah, I, I don't want to play it on an emulator at all. I want to play it on the actual game I don't want to play some scuffed bullshit. I want to play the actual the actual game itself and I don't like I want it to be made for PC so it's not ghetto like I've already played Dark Souls 2 and, and like the PC port for that is terrible Tally says there's no plans for it to be on PC 